Hello, welcome back. So let's continue. Bruce Seconder One, I've got that intel you requested on Louis Sarah. It seems he used to be a researcher for Umbrella. Umbrella? I should have left him in that bag to rot. <laughs> I'm sending you the details. Take a look, but Baby Eagle is your priority. Copy that. Making my way to the church. Condor One, out. Baby Eagle is super annoying. So yeah, I was really wondering what's with that treasure, but it looks like it's still there. It looks like it's in the attic. Hmm. I don't think we can jump on the window. Yeah, it's kind of cool playing it blind. I'm actually I'm happy I didn't play Resident Evil 4 to the end. I only played a little bit. I guess I should save here, you know, just in case we're going to have a lot of problems with uh, whatever is downstairs. Although at this stage of the game you don't have a lot of materials. I don't remember the toilet. <laughs> it's such a fancy place and then you look at this, oh no, it's it's a toilet, basically a hole in the ground. At least they have toilet paper. I guess we can look around a little bit to see if anything else changed. No, nothing changed. The non cooked us a tasty meal. <laughs> Dog? You too, huh? We have to release the good boy. I have to hit someone. Take care yourself, buddy. Hit someone infected with the last plague, guys, and he becomes a little bit of a mutated dog and has healing powers. Otherwise, that would have broken his leg. Because that's what those traps are designed to do: break the legs of little animals. I don't think they can break the leg of a human. At least not, not if. At least not if they are this old. Probably bear trap can do it, but that still be pushing it a little bit. So I guess you can only go up there in a certain time period. I don't know. I guess this is what I don't like about the game. This game. It's not very clear what you can do and what you cannot do. But I still like exploring, and it's also kind of dark now. Kind of late. There, I fixed that. No one will ever get caught in those again. Oh yeah, I forgot to get a small key, so I guess we can open... We can open, I think, a drawer. In the village. Set us. Also, it looks like there is no treasure for quite a long while until we reach the village. I like this character design. I like this character. Uh, well, I like how he's designed. This game has much better, I don't know, proportions than other ones I've seen. Probably. The best thing since Resident Evil 6, something like that. A 
Okay, so I cannot shoot the bats. Why would they lock the gate on the other side? Why would the gate lock behind me? Well, we completely looted this place, so there is no point in searching for anything. I don't think we have to, you know, murder those crows. That was particularly, particularly violent and vicious attack on my person. I guess I should just use this one. Do these dogs have two mouths? Mm, no, they just have two sets of teeth. Okay. So I guess you have two treasures over there, but only one way to access it with a friend. Probably another piece of jewelry. Vintage compass, well, huh. looks like somebody got lost in here. <laughs> so, I guess that's only 5,000 pesetas, which is not really a great deal, is it? I'm not sure how you're supposed to deal with those wolves. I guess you have to run away and go for the traps or something. Yeah, probably you should have used the traps to fight with them. But I guess that also works. <laughs> That's my reward for killing the crow. Oh, those are... Okay, the villagers are over there. So I can guess I can, go for, I can go and fight them. Probably that's the only option we have left anyway. Yeah, so you can only go through the house, making you fight them in close quarters.
who keeps putting up all of these explosives over here? This village don't seem to have enough intelligence not to close the door on their face. That, that's kind of a funny thing because if they turn their back to you like that, you can stab them. But stabbing them uses half knife durability. such a clean break of the blade oh it's the snake I forgot about that I mean, I sort of knew about it, but I forgot about that. Well, I, I guess we can eat it. So you lose health, the snake loses its life, and I gain a dinner. How much health is that? That's actually a lot of health. Even if it bites you, you can get more health out of it. So all of these villages basically went into this church. Well, it, it's awkward because Salvador also goes with them in the church. El Gigante. This guy again, he's not getting any prettier, you know, no matter how many pictures you take of him, he's not getting prettier. I don't know, see, this is my problem. If you know how to do things the right way, you can do them very easy, but since I don't know the right way, I'll just go into this well first, since I want to see what's here. And I hope it's the, you know, it's not the right way, I hope it's the wrong way, so I can get more loot, but not more fights. I guess the rat, this rat doesn't drop anything. Hmm. Oh, okay, so this just takes you back to the village. Yeah. I think I I got all of the traps. <laughs> the wildlife wildlife is safe. 
I didn't know that's all of the chickens are either gone or probably eaten by something. This is pushed over here. Hmm. Probably we should be able to wash the pearl medallion. Ah, I forgot. So, see, this is another problem with the game. You're supposed to know certain things that are only meta knowledge. I thought you could be able to wash the necklace in the water over here in the fountain, but nope. Okay, before we go into the church, let me look at something over here. No, nothing new. I don't know, maybe some professionals will know more than me. There is another difficulty to the game by doing professional. Which should be very, very interesting for us. <laughs> I don't know. In a way, I'm just admiring the game. In a way, I want to see what's next. In a way, I don't want to watch tips and tricks or where all of the loot is. But yeah, generally, I take this game very slow because I want to enjoy it as it deserves. Because like this might be the best Resident Evil game. <coughs> Or at least according to me, because, you know, it has the most gameplay. Actually, we can look at the documents first. Sleep well and flourish, child. Uh, body grows your mother's shall see new small clothes. At seven quintal of wheat and half a bull a day, you have outgrown your pen. Huh. This spray is magical. I guess I can make more. Uh, I can make more crossbow bolts, or I could make more submachine gun ammo, which would be a lot more useful, or rifle ammo. But I don't have any of those guns. I don't know. I guess I just have to remember I have these. I've got some new items in stock. <laughs> Come take a look. <laughs> Sell free vipers? Oh no! I eat the viper. That's delicious. Well, I guess now I know. Don't eat the vipers. Oh, nothing but the finest. Welcome. I don't like his voice. He doesn't have any magic to the voice. Trash grenades. Bang for your buck. I guarantee it. He doesn't have any more special offers on sale, does he? No. Well, you Good should always repair you, first of all your knife. Hmm, if that's you want a fighting chance out there, you best tune up your kit. Repair unnecessary. Well, to be honest, I think uh, rifles and some automatic weapons. That cash in your pocket or your life. Easy choice, mate. Try that on for size. Ruby's all rubbish. It makes no difference. The price, well. That's our choice to make. Will that be your comeback? Does the compass have anything to it? Just as examine. I think it has something we can do with it.
Okay, let me look at something on the internet because I don't want... I think it was something with the compass, but I don't remember. So, I don't think it does anything. Any time. No, we can sell it. Your valuable a deal well pleasant travels. Oh yeah, I forgot there's something else in the town hall. Yeah, I heard something dangling but I forgot about it. No it did Something's bound to catch your So do you do the velvet blues? Hmm. Mm -hmm. For selling right. only short. Welcome. Got a selection of good things on sale, stranger. I'll buy almost pleasure doing business with you. You can still get the punisher and Russian power to lower recoil on the other side. Herbs, we do. Heal a man. Kill a man, they do it all. <laughs> so we have a yellow gemstone, probably is worth more, but I don't think I can get all of them. It would help me so much if I would knew the stats before all of these things. Will that come back any time? So this is 1.3. I guess we can take a look at the Punisher pistol just for science. Just about any pleasant travels. So, oh, it actually has less power than the other pistol. <clears throat> oh, but it's super accurate. Can I do you for? Knife needs care every once in a while. Could be the difference between life and death. I guess if you buy, yeah, this Ruby's is kind of a rubbish. It makes no difference. Kind of a problem. Price. You basically can get ten thousand from the weapons you don't need. Got a select <laughs> suit. Stranger. I guess we can play with both pistols and you know we should really defeat the ammo of one of them and then we can see what's next. Welcome. Probably the knife is your the best thing to invest your money. In good hands, man. This kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Little bit goes a long way. You see. What's that? How have we procured these curiosities? <laughs> you come back any time. Yeah, I don't want to know. Let me guess. I don't want to know. So yeah, I guess I should have bought this pistol since the beginning, since it has much better, you know, accuracy than the rest. So use up this ammo and then yeah. Fine. Use up that ammo, then we'll switch guns again. This way. I guess it's a good time to end the video. See you next time. Bye bye.